You haven't played with them yet? Uh, you can recruit them in Sicily. I think you're here somewhere. I don't, I don't actually remember where we got them. Or how we got them, that is. One of these settlements actually allows you to... I think Syracuse itself allows you to recruit them. If you build the... Uh, what's it called? The barracks there. We hunger for battle, Commander. Well, Let them tower nice knowing you. Ready for battle. Leave none alive. Yeah, they are a uh, levy unit. Not gonna deal with the sieges in this game anymore. Carthage was bad enough. Like we got like ladder stuck. One of the ladder units literally spread a line of one unit, one by one unit, like diagonally off the wall for for some reason they couldn't move the ladder. We hunger for battle. Yeah, we're gonna have supply problems here. That's why I was inching towards them. And that's it for them. Okay, this is gonna be easy. We just need to take that one up there, then this one here. And just move up the coast. Or the problem is gonna be this one here. Oh my god, it's gonna take forever. And they're gonna start out in two turns as well. That's bad. I might need to... Resupply them there first. Hmm, four settlements in the desert, yeah. Well, one is not in the desert, right? This one, I don't think this, is, this one counts as desert aid either. Commander! Commander! Maybe I should have attacked with him so he gets some experience. Probably that was a better idea. Yeah, let's uh, look through what we can build. Upgrade this. Hmm, yeah, which one do we want here? Public order, public order. And we're not going to be recruiting from here, so that might not be that good. Stadium might be better. I can always convert it to this, because uh, we might have some sanitation issues. I do, I do have the baggage trains on each, on each army, so that helps a little bit. Come on, you're standing in the bushes. You should be fine. Three turns on this one. Eight turns on this one. Right, let's see here. What do I see here? Circus Maximus or the Colosseum? Which requires trained slaves. Are we actually gonna get that? <laughs> We're actually... gonna get squalor for him everything so it's not gonna matter that much let's go for gladiators
Kind of interesting that the cottage hasn't, uh, like, uh, had a, a stack or two come at us. They did have a couple of battles on, in Sicily. Like, they, I had the, an army in ambush. And they attacked one of the settlements. Well, they attacked both settlements with, like, three sta full stacks and a navy. Those were some good times. Back before we had Hestati. I think. Or the, like, uh, reforms, that is. So they were all spear infantry. If I remember. Uh, the videos are coming out on the channel if you want to watch that. From the beginning. Oh no. Is he gonna incite a revolt? Nah. Okay, finally enough, I'm gonna need to fight this. We don't lose any extra troops. Do you know? Is, was it always like you need to control all the capture points of a settlement or just some of them? Because we had one defensive battle, I think, in north of Italy, where I just, you know, held the capital thing, like, you know, where they, I don't know, the, you know, the main building is, and the other, and the attacking army just captured one of the capture points, and uh, we lost because of that. Like, do I need to control both of these? That's gonna suck if I do. Okay, so... Keep all of you back. That's for sure. Thanks for the sub, by the way. Did I lose a cav unit? Yeah, that's fucking stupid. Why do I need to control all of these? And they only need to take one. Like, come on. No, yeah, this one is even worse. Looks like I lost the cav unit at some point somewhere. Okay, let's use up all the militia first. Yeah, it's fucking so like you can't deploy the deployables like outside. Like, what? I don't need them inside. I don't need them that much inside, I guess. And they're gonna probably gonna go for this one. Since uh, it's the closest one. Here we can use these. And these. I guess we'll see where they go with the ladders. Then I'm gonna make up my mind where I'm gonna place all these. Okay, do Use them as well. I'm gonna place them like Missiles here. I think you should be able to. Maybe you can't garrison these. Missiles awaiting targets. Or like get on the walls there. We await your command. Yeah, no problem. See ya. Good luck, no much. There we go. Missile armed riders. We can use these as well. We can use these to flank actually a little bit. We await your command. As for the rest of you, stay there. Coming straight at us. Our reinforcements have arrived. Principes! Double time! I guess since they're only gonna attack the walls. Ooh. General! Do 
good. We can use these to attack them. Why can't I retreat them down? That's a bit of pain in the ass. Okay, we're not gonna use you. I'm gonna use those to kill the archers. place these up there. Triarii. Jupiter gives us strength. Orders, my lord, ready. Archers. Guard. Spear infantry, ready. For the gods. Principes. Oh no. Wait a minute. The missile infantry went for the cab. Good idea. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Oh god, they got missile. Ca oh, sh uh, you get in. You get inside. Come on. Just in case. Oh yeah, all well, their skirmish cavalry is gonna go for the equites now. Oh, that's gonna suck ass. I guess you get out out of there as well. Italian swordsman. Oh, this is where I wish you could retreat units so you can actually use all the other ones. Reinforcements. Two cav units. Might be a problem actually recruiting more of them. So can't really retreat them either. Yeah, these ones are getting wrecked, for example. Yep. much I can do with that or about that look 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 what the hell are they well, that line's gonna be a fucking he it's gonna be huge All right, let's move these archers down I could have moved them back in the city, but that's not sure how well that would have gone. To be honest. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Okay, look at that. Two of them. Actually, are blocked. Melee infantry at your command. Attack! We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Italian cavalry. This is gonna stretch to the end of the map, apparently. Oh shit. I didn't even notice. One of our units has used all its ammunition. They're actually using the light cab units. Our men 
men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Why is there fucking infantry catching up to my cav? Well, sure, bring in more in more of my infantry into the battle. That's gonna go well for you. So this is when, uh, when you can't retreat, you, uh, maybe I should have just pushed the garrison outside so they get wrecked. Yeah, that would have been a better idea. Looks like the AI fixed that actually. is turning in our favor the battle was always in our favor game come on might as well just get out and kill him at this point yeah probably a better idea Light spear. <laughs> Light spears. Oh god damn. Fortunately we did lose uh, two or three caveats because of them. So how are reinforcement? Why can't I retreat them though? They're outside the settlement. That sucks. Then again I can't just recruit them at Carthage. Smart enough to actually stop uh, moving them. One of 
our units has used all its ammunition. Actually, they are. Look at that. One of our units has used all its ammunition. That's gonna be annoying. What did, what else could you do? Just move them back in settlement, apparently. Nothing else. Nothing. Not really much else you can do, actually. I've used these, I guess, to chase down the archers. Maybe. Yep. You can't just move them back there to recruit. At least that's... That's there. Even more generals now. Wait, you to move up there. You get the fuck out of there. Your next command. Grab those. We need them. for all units, morale all units, male attack for all cav. Let's go with that one. At your command. And we're gonna need to wait a little bit longer. Or actually, right, we can just recruit uh, one there and just move up and into another region and recruit another one. Be easy enough. Get the oh, I see what the issue is. We need to build a supply pit here instantly. And here as well. Grab that. Supply pit. Alright, we have a port there, that's why. Let's build a... Um, aqueduct here. Yeah, aqueduct. Your command. If we can take out Carthage this three, should be able to. They only have like Northern Africa left and a couple of settlements in Af in Spain or Iberia. Should be doable. 
But uh, there's probably going to be some issues here and there. Probably public order issues, to be exact. Although our risk of uh, civil war is pretty low, so we should be fine on that front as well. That's like the worst thing. I, I for, the, for the longest time, didn't even pay attention to the politics. I got wrecked by a civil war once it happened. Okay, that's done. I do need to check these always. So let's place him there because he only has one turn. Right, I was bringing this army down. I needed to dock him for a turn. We do have two fleets down here. Which I'm gonna keep like there just in case. But enemy attack. Let's upgrade the buildings here. I think this is going to be more useful. Now we're going to have enough food here. Should be. Should be fine. Let's go with the growth. Growth is always good. Ways, I think that's gonna be. Let's see if we can do something in diplomacy. You warm up yet? Not really. Greetings, Epirus. Come on, man. Look at them. They're actually expanding pretty well. They make it easier for us to conquer one of one faction, not multiple of them. I welcome you, worthy speaker. I listen because your people are known to have honor. They're gonna attack them, right? Their client states. I do want a peace or a non aggression pact with the. I don't wanna go towards Egypt yet. Because they are kinda actually considered stronger than us as well. I mean, that means nothing, but still. Right, I did lose two cav units here or something like that. Yeah, right. These. Because they spawned in on the edge and I couldn't move them anywhere. Except in the, in the, into the castle. Ready for so we need to go up there. What? Someone assassin there. How may I serve you? So you move up there, see where they're... They had one army standing right there. Where is it now? Oh, I see. Okay, let's send the turn, see what happens. I'm surprised to see the Egyptians doing so well. I thought they were gonna crumple beneath Carthage and uh, Seleucids by now. But no, apparently they're actually stronger than them. I love that the enemy armies are just sitting on my border. Like, you know, yeah, leave your cities undefended. What could possibly go wrong? I'm gonna need to fight this one manually again. Just so we don't lose any units. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. We can just move back to the Carthage area and recruit more, but... I'd rather not do that, to be honest.
Guess we can flank him with the troops this way. Anyways. So since they're AI, they're AI, they're gonna go up the ladders, no matter what. Put them there. Oh, these are plebs. I noticed that. You just stay up there. We're gonna flank with these. And these two. do they have actually light spears missile missile medium spear infantry yeah that's gonna be easy enough to deal with Swift and accurate. In the name of Rome. we have discovered the enemy's hidden units or actually they could have more They have missile cam, whatever shall we do? Now they're getting some kills. Nice. Oh, that's bad. We need to wipe them out. It may not be as easy if you can't catch up to them. We did already lose one general to a stupid fight like this, so let's not lose another one. and charges. Faster. Yeah, we do. We I do want to like kill them all, so we don't run into any of them after this. You just charge him. We're gonna kill him with plebs, man. Best kind of infantry. Guys are just taking their sweet ass time to get there. Oh, 
what? They're not gonna let me kill them all? Uh, there's about a hundred of them left. Oh god, I hope this ends him. So I have to chase him down on the desert. If I did the ultra resolve it, I would have probably lost one cav unit or two even. Which is a bit annoying. thing they actually show you in the new total wars if we're gonna lose any units or not oh fuck six have your guts emptied at the thought of an attack nope not yet anyway Funny thing is, these guys attack them, they retreat and they come back right back to that spot where they sat at when they attacked them. That's been going on for like three... Yeah, look at that. Artificial intelligence. Now, ladies and gentlemen. He's gonna run away. No, he's actually gonna stay there. Noise. On the move. Okay, so it's gonna take one turn to replenish those. Right, I need a spy over here as well. Okay, he can make it there in one turn. How may I serve you? My hmm. skills are yours. We do attack that. He can't help them, right? No, he cannot. We'd like to get the defensive battle, to be honest. I do I have seen it done. Can we declare war on them without any penalties? Well met, friend. Say yes. your words move me to anger or agreement as you wish of them. Yes, we can. Ready for battle. Oh, hey, what? Greetings, friend. Let us use our time to get. No, oh, I declare war. Fuck. <laughs> declare war on the wrong faction. Uh, doesn't matter. I think our guys are at war with them anyway. Y yeah, they are. My friend, speak. You are not your friends. Let them oh, we can't get there in one turn. Shit. Ready for battle. Ready for orders. Yeah, we need you to drop those off down there. Ready, right there, we we'll need to recruit another unit. We're gonna keep these ships here for now. Police reporting. Moving out. We need the aqueducts here. Let me upgrade this so I don't have to look at it ever again. That's about all our money. Let's, uh, who are we sending over there anyway? I think we were sending over their wives. Tepros, for example. Let's send some to Knossos, why not? Maybe get some money from them. Oh no. 
got them agents. I wonder if there's so many, like, uh, no agent mods for the AI. They're so annoying. Let's see if those two do it again. He moved an inch into my territory. All right. They didn't even raid. And they left tails. Uh, I guess that uh, that happened because I poisoned them. They couldn't move any further. Look at that. It's gonna keep happening, man. I might need to kill him. Oh my god, that's so fucking bullshit. Faction culture influence, spread owning culture, and the Nibar provinces, public order duty. Yes. It's the fucking tree people, man. And they're in the fucking desert. Oh god damn it. Uh can we piece them out? I am here then. Speak your words and be sure that I find profit in them. Apparently every faction is very strong in this game as well. <laughs> I will accept this in my lord's name. Hey yo, what's up? What about the trade agreement? Oh we can get even oh, look at that. Admire your sense and clear thinking. Makes sense, doesn't it? My people will rejoice. On the move. It is a great and glorious thing to die for Rome. Ready for going ashore. Out of the oars, you fleet reporting. We're gonna need to you to go back up there. We don't have sight on that at all. No, they have two armies. I can't. Where's their other? It's probably there somewhere. I do. Sabotage. Besieging the settlement. Yeah, do I want to fight this? That's gonna be a cake walk. Ah, sure, why not? No, oh, this is a pretty small settlement as well. No, I, I like most of the time, I'm not gonna spread out my troops, I'm gonna leave them in one. Because uh, I think the air is going to just run, rush out at us. And let's not fight them uphill. Let's stand like here. Come out. Let's see what happens. To stand against us, the might of Rome. Have they no sense? Or do they crave death as the drunkard craves wine? Quickly now! Forward! 
Yeah, looks like they are gonna come at us, so... Uh, let's move you a bit back. Oh no, they got skirmish we have. I mean, this thing, uh, the fact that they charge out makes things, uh, I guess, just a little bit faster. Nothing else. I mean, it's not like they're going to survive this or anything. Ready for orders. Commander. Orders. Hmm. Actually, are they going to attack or are they just going to sit there? Might just sit there to be honest. I think they are gonna sit there because they, they think they actually have a ranged advantage. Or the problem is that, like, what the hell is passable? Okay, yeah, this is passable, this here is passable, I guess, terrain. Figuring that that was gonna be a pain in the ass. Okay, let's move them all the way around. Slightly inch upwards. Shock cavalry ready. Principes. Group this ready and waiting. Roman ready for duty. Socky equites extraordinary. I wonder who's gonna win. My ushers or theirs. They are firing on my infantry. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Well, let's move him a little bit back so he doesn't get sniped like the last one did. Oh, will I be able to actually sandwich these? I'll try. Fuck is this? Look at that. Fucking... It's like you're fighting a... If, it's like you're playing a fighting game and the, the air yeah, like... Breeds inputs. So freaking annoying. So you go this way. You charge him. Where they stop? Okay, you charge him then. Well, this is gonna be a nice place to actually like. Uh, how about you go this way? Come on. Stand with him.
Look at this, you're broken. That flank. I was like, what the fuck are they firing at? Should just get out of the way at this point how about you actually go into battle to have fun in these games is to actually play head to head or actually get the real challenge that's a better said like that you can still have fun but like to get the real challenge in battles at least well um, and in campaign I guess you have to play with someone else in a head to head campaign now even if you're not at the same skill level when it comes to micromanaging, you're still gonna have more fun than playing versus uh, AI. Easy peasy. Now this army can actually reach both of these. Oh, there's the other army. Noise just in time. Make haste, men. Ready for battle. Anything else we need to upgrade? E right, I forgot about this. I'm surprised the public order is this good here. Well, I mean, decent. Let's send you to Epirus. Send you to these guys, even though they declared war on me. Let's go send the ones to Egypt. Yeah, that's. I mean, Illyricum doesn't matter. I almost want to, like, abandon it at this point. It'll be an interesting battle if these two actually attacked this. Or both of the armies attacked at the same time. How many turns of the Who? What's the supply like here? Not very good. That's why I don't want to go and fight these down here. It's a fucking desert. What's up, sludge? That's your command. These guys declared war on me and I just immediately pieced them out and got a trade deal with them. <laughs> and got some money from them. That's how it's done. I think Carthage just gave him money to like go to war with me and I just uh, ask for peace and get some of the money back. That works out. Carthage gives the money, I take the money. <laughs> I 
I think the most of the factions we did run into are actually like considered pretty economically strong as well, which is um, something. Come on. I don't want to let them attack that, to be honest. I want a big battle. This time they went the oh look at that. They actually got taken out this time around. Yeah you wood people go over there. Or tree, like the icon of their faction. The tree. Data. Probably called it all provinces, penalty to all income from trading, and two of those. Nice. What do we need here? Move speed for all units, melee attack skill for infantry. Definitely. Cav, Empire Maintenance. Uh, let's go for morale. At your command. Now I guess I could just uh, move these in there, kill them off. That would be the smarter idea. Let's go for food here. Is there any way we can increase supplies? In the like lower settlements? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so we can, but we need to go with that. I guess. What do we go with double food? Let's go for that one that the nurses. Right, we do. Hmm. Now let's go with growth, then we're gonna increase supply or food later on. 